Sprite and Coke every day, but how much acid is in that soda being consumed? How much acid is in fruit juice and soft drinks? Safety is very important in this lab as you use 12 molar HCl, which is very strong and very dangerous. Therefore, when handling the acid, you will need gloves. Also, when performing the titration, you will need goggles and an apron. Also, make sure not to spill any of the acid or base onto your skin. And if this happens, simply rinse the acid or base off of the skin and then consult your teacher. A titration is a process or method for determining the concentration of an unknown solution by adding a known solution of a known concentration. Light colored sodas such as Sprite and fruit juices contain the weak acid, citric acid. It reacts with NaOH in the following reaction. Dark color sodas such as Coca-Cola contain the weak acid, phosphoric acid. It reacts with NaOH in the following reaction. After setting up the burette as shown, rinse the burette with the solution of sodium hydroxide. Then fill up the burette with the solution up to the 50 milliliter mark. Move the hot plate to underneath the burette. Put a magnet inside the beaker containing the weak acid and place the beaker on the hot plate. In this pre-lab, you will need solutions of hydrochloric acid, acetic acid, and sodium hydroxide. To make both the hydrochloric and acetic acids, you will need to use the formula molarity times volume is equal to molarity times volume. For the sodium hydroxide, you will need to use dimensional analysis to find the ground with any OH that you will need as it comes in the form of solid power. After adding the indicator, add the NaOH to the test tube containing HCl with a disposable pipette to the solution change pump.
can use an indicator in a titration when the analyte, the substance that you are trying to find the concentration of, is colorless. An indicator marks the endpoint of a titration by changing color. The endpoint is pretty much when the number of moles of base added is equal to the number of moles of acid. In this weak acid strong base titration, phenolphthalein was used. Before any base is added, add one or two drops of the indicator into the solution. When you have a solution that is not colorless, such as a dark soda, you will need to use a Vernier pH electrode. Plug the USB cable to the computer and attach the pH sensor. Uncap the electrode from the buffer solution and immerse it fully into the solution. On the computer, open up Logger Pro. Then open the folder Advanced Chemistry and select the file 07A acid base. Once the pH reading stabilizes, press collect and then keep. Since no base has been added, type in zero. Repeat this continuously after adding base. Remember to slowly Oh, <laughs> shit.